When top designers make a masterpiece, the world pays attention. That's why in this video, we will be talking about how Ellie Saab wedding dresses are made, how long they take, and why the designer has earned a lot of respect for his creations. But before we begin, make sure you subscribe to the luxury list and turn on your notification for more interesting videos like this one. If you've done that, great, let's begin. From Halle Berry to the Queen of Jordan, Ellie Saab has dressed notable people and has earned his rightful place as one of the greatest designers in the world. The Lebanese designer specializes in making the finest haute couture wedding dresses from the most expensive fabrics, pearls, detailed embroidery, Swarovski crystal, lace, and gemstones. Although he started his business far back in 1980 and has made a name for himself to an extent, it wasn't until Hollywood actress Halle Berry wore one of the creations to accept an Oscar at the 2002 Academy Awards that his monumental moment came. Her mesh-embroidered top red dress solidified his position as a sought-after designer. According to him, Halle Berry made the name Ali Saab more popular. She managed to really put the name Ali Saab on the international market. Yes, Saab's red carpet dresses are stunning, but his wedding dresses are none like you have ever seen before. The man is simply a genius at what he does. No wonder the Lebanese press nicknamed him Precious Genius. He creates his magic at his main workshop in Lebanon and also at his additional workshops in Milan and Paris. Although Saab makes most of his sketches, he still works with some of the best dressmakers to complete the wedding dress. So don't think he does the entire work to make a dress. A team works with him to cut, embroider, and put together each of Saab's ideas while he makes sure everything is as he expects it to be. A notorious example is the wedding dress his daughter-in-law, Christina Murad, wore for her wedding to his son, Ali Saab Jr. The wedding was a three-day affair and we saw not one, but two of his creations. Her first dress was an elaborate high princess gown with a high neck bodice and a 4.5 meter train. The dress was made from ivory silk, luxury lace material, and champagne lurex adorned with 500,000 sequins. The amazing dress took a village to create. To complete it, it took three pattern makers to create the patterns for the wedding dress. Creating patterns can be done manually or digitally. In most cases, haute couture fashion houses like Ellie Saab tend to do a lot of their work by hands, taking a lot of time, making the dress very expensive. Aside from the pattern makers, there are also 12 embroiderers who were responsible for decorating the fabric of Christina's wedding dress. They use needles to apply treads to the fabric at the same time incorporating other materials like beads, sequins, pearls, and gemstones. There were also six tailors who were saddled with the responsibility of constructing, modifying, and putting every piece of the dress together. They were also responsible for taking her measurements and making additional adjustments at every fitting. And finally, there was not one, not two, but ten petit thaman on ground during the production of the wedding dress. Of course, the petit thaman is not a strange word in fashion. It is, however, a French word that means tiny hands and they are ateliers and individual artisans that work with top fashion designers and houses. Basically, they help determine what fabric works well to bring the vision of the wedding dress to life. They also suggest techniques and the perfect construction methods to achieve the perfect silhouette for Christina. Well, if you think the number of hands required to make the dress is a little bit over the top, wait until you discover how long it took to complete it. P.S. If you would like Ellie Saab to take care of your wedding gown, you must book months before your wedding day because it is not a few weeks affair. It actually took 200 hours of tailoring, 450 hours of embroidery, and 80 hours of embroidery design before the dress was finally ready. Even Christina can testify that the gown did delay her wedding. According to her fiance, Ellie Jr., would have loved to get married after a year of the proposal, but his father, Ellie Saab, told them it was not enough time to prepare a wedding, much less the wedding dress. Her dress was definitely not cheap. It cost up to $100,000 to make this gorgeousness. And while her first wedding dress was breathtaking, the second was just as beautiful. For the reception, Christina walked in an Elisab Haute Couture Gold and Beige Rosé heart-shaped corset gown adorned with 150,000 Zervoski Strass pieces and 650,000 gold sequins. The gown was first seen at the Ellie Saab 2019-2020 Fall Winter Collection. It might not be as expensive as the wedding dress, but it isn't cheap either, costing up to $30,000. 
The dress also showed Eli Saab was a master at his craft. No wonder he became the first Arab admitted into the Chambre Syndicale de la Haute Couture, the fashion industry's governing body. His mastery also made him the perfect fit as a judge on Project Runway the Middle East in 2016. Elisab's wedding dresses have remained one of the most sought after with big names. And while his daughter-in-law's dress is captivating, she isn't the only bride that has stunned in one of his wedding dresses. In 2016, Armenian billionaire Sarkis Karpetian got married to Georgian beauty Salome in a lavish wedding reported to have cost $2 million. The bride wore three wedding dresses, but it was the elaborate long-sleeved floor-sweeping train from Ali Saab that caught our attention. The dress was made from the finest lace and adorned with pearls and sequins. The dress reportedly cost $35,000. Aside from the Georgian beauty, Game of Thrones star Rose Leslie also showed up for her wedding to Game of Thrones co-star Kit Harington in a Saab wedding dress. The dress was an elegant piece of art. It had a skinny belt, sheer sleeves, and boat neck that gave it its timeless appearance. The dress reportedly cost $20,000. Saab isn't only dressing billionaire and Hollywood brides. He has also dressed some royal figures, including Princess Claire of Luxembourg, for her wedding to Prince Felix of Luxembourg in 2013. The former model wore a stunning piece from the brand. The dress was made from the finest ivory silk, embroidered with Chantilly lace floral motifs and a gorgeous 10-foot-long train. Lebanese bride Rem Ashour also had Elisa make her wedding dress. The dress was a lavish sleeveless sparkling ball gown adorned with different colors including pink and blue. It was simply a piece of art and it glittered throughout the wedding. And while we have only mentioned real life brides, there is nothing wrong with slipping in some fictional characters that were brides and wore Ellie Saab wedding dresses. One of them is Blair Waldorf, the popular Gossip Girl character played by Leighton Meester, who wore an icy blue long sleeve dress to marry Chuck Bass during the show's last episode. The dress made her look every inch of an elegant bride, and we don't care if it was only for a movie role. We continue to see Ali Saab Ott on several celebrities, including Beyonce, Christina Aguilera, Ashwarya Rai, Elsa Zilberstein, Catherine Zeta-Jones, Anna Kendrick, Priyanka Chopra, Kendall Jenner, Celine Dion, Amelia Clark, Angelina Jolie, Heidi Klum, Helen Mirren, Carly Kloss, Nicki Minaj, Elena Anya, Taylor Swift, and Sanam Kapoor. We love Ali Saab's collection, and if you do too and would like to get your hands on some of his precious wares, you can always check out Paris, London, and Beirut, where his couture collections are available for anyone that is looking. His ready-to-wear collections are also available at one of over 160 retail shops located all over the world, and in his own boutiques that can be found in London, Geneva, New York City, Dubai, Doha, Moscow, Mexico, Paris, and Hong Kong. Ellie Saab haute couture wedding dresses are definitely not for the tight-fisted. Would you like to wear one of his creations for your wedding? Let us know in the comment section. While you're at that, make sure to hit the subscribe button to subscribe to the luxury list and turn on your notification so you will be the first to know when we upload new videos. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. See you in the next one.